Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show how to install Ubuntu 13.10 on your Android device. To do it, you need to have some apps like Android VNC, Linux, Zipploy, Terminal Emulator, BusyBox, this one only, not uh, other one. Uh, complete Linux installer. Uh, first, uh, under an app called uh, BitTorrent or any torrent. Uh, once you have downloaded all, open the complete Linux installer, go to menu, go to installation guides, choose the Ubuntu 13.10 uh, and go to paste to and click on download image. If you want the KDE and play the screen and a high end, download the large, otherwise uh, you have an optional small image and core image. But as small image and core image both sizes are, are equal but in small image uh, once it is, has been extracted. 2 GB storage will be taken uh, if the core image means only 1 GB. Uh, I am going to download uh, uh, this one. Uh, torrent, file, uh, torrent file is recommended because uh, uh, it has a so uh, it can download from a recipe. You will see, I already had downloaded it. Once it has been downloaded, uh, extract it. I gonna use this thing yes file manager mm -hmm. otherwise uh, I prefer a recommended thing is RAR it is a very fast extractor and a good extractor ever I had uh, observed uh, wait until it over see uh, it, uh, this app can extract RAR, zip, star G dot uh, GZ and BZ2 XZ 7Z all the things once you are downloaded I open it go to your downloads uh, extract it you will get two files one is you uh, uh, one is 3 GB and one is a uh, small thing uh, no extract here two okay uh, one each, uh, uh, wait until it extracts hey guys see it has been extracted once it has been extracted uh, it, uh, open your favorite file manager copy the to do I gonna cut paste to uh, your root of your file or root of your SD card no or rename it you should rename it otherwise it will not work uh, just rename it as Ubuntu and rename these as just uh, Ubuntu.img and this too but uh, you should uh, um, the, do this as ubuntu.img.md file once it has been done uh, now open the next supply app now go to menu uh, now change it to ubuntu uh, and change this to that path but the main thing is should or rename the zero to legacy and set the location like uh, I have kept it you Ubuntu and a slash and you want to do that Now here is the thing, uh, change the desktop environment to KDE because you have as done as KDE for a verification, I gonna check it, uh, yeah, it's a capital letter or small letter my folder all are small uh, uh, now all are same just click on here, reconfig, so that it uh, reconfigs click on hello
wait until it's over uh, a speed network is recommended because there are 5 mb files 1 kb file 4 mb files etc etc on that uh, a speed network is recommended my net speed is 10 mbps so i have no problem Uh, see in 39 seconds it has downloaded uh, 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 19.8 but uh, sometimes when network speed goes down that's why it is fine out 4 kb ps uh, see uh, only 16 kb file has been downloaded uh, like that uh -huh. there will be even 1 kb sometimes 1 gb is too Let it do all things. I will check my charging so that I should connect my original. Mm -hmm. Once it has been turned, just check. I want to clear it. If you want, you can clear it. I want to stop it. Then click on start. See, it has been started. Then uh, open app called uh, VNC Android VNC. Uh, for nickname, you can keep anything like I am going to keep Ubuntu. Next up, password. Uh, type as change me c h a n g e m e. Uh, and then for the address, leave it out or type in localhost. Code it has been set automatically. If you are using a uh, optical mouse, just connect it. it means origin mouse. I'm gonna connect. It. Now click, just click on connect. See, we are in uh, Linux. If you want, uh, if you are facing same problem as me, it is vertical. Then just go to, uh, go to the uh, Linux deploy again. Click on stop now. Go to menu. Go to settings. Now, uh. Uh, from bottom come to the <coughs> not the settings click on download button go to the G GUI settings not this thing go to this thing now make the height as width and width as height Let's go back. I'm gonna clear it. Just click on start again. Now go to Android VNC. There, yes, click on connect. Uh, I'm gonna here. Uh, you will need KDE. I gonna connect my OTG. Oh. You have a menu here, you have computer, no computer, you can go to you a root. See 
we have MLG open it uh, this cannot be the Android files the uh, see we, uh, if you have more uh, if you have a higher device it is will be very good uh, see we have office drawing things etc etc things here is a terminal uh, you can do anything with it. if uh, you want just a terminal then, uh, you need to download an other app named uh, connect boot I forgot to keep this in the list just open it uh, just click uh, now here type as root at the rate of localhost for the port uh, use 22 now when it asks the password wait until it comes Uh, for the password you need to type as tor t o o r that's it we are in a uh, we are in linux now